All right, it's game three of the NHL Stanley, Stanley Cup playoffs on a beast here. As we're about to wrap things up here to finish the second game. And if all you enjoying here for the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports, we uh, appreciate your support here the first round. But we will be sticking things in the second round after this game of the Stanley Cup playoffs to start the second round. Now, we'll let's fa face it off to focus on this game as we have the LA Kings facing up against the Oilers and this time they're playing at Edmonton, Canada. Right in the uh, right in the central of the of this country. This is going to be another match of the face things again and again as the Kings haven't just played here at Canada since long time and since uh, many years ago back in the early then and we always USA teams comes to Canada teams and Canada teams comes to USA too. Well, it's a difference in between those two guys, but who will have it all carried out? The lineups are being occurred as Anze Kopitar, Drew Doughty, then it's Connor McDavid, Leon Drestel, and Darnell Nurse. So it's time to rally things at Rogers Center here at Edmonton, Canada to start the third game. Let's bring it on with the next playoff match here of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Hi everybody, James Sabowski and Ray Ferraro for EA Sports. Looking forward to this one tonight. Rogers Place. I haven't seen this one, but we'll see them for next season. Both teams are lined up and we are set to get things going. The Kings take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway. Wrist shot on the slot. That's blocked by Smith. Oh, he snaps the glove save off there. Excellent chance in the slot. Kopitar is great at reading the play and intercepting pucks, guys. That's his quick pick zone ability, and he uses it to get his team going. McDavid's foot speed can make him dangerous, and that's his wheel zone ability. I'm expecting one of these two players to be the biggest impact for their team tonight. Back to you guys. Loose the puck. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Green hits up play with the stick by Kippen. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The game is still scoreless. Los Angeles wins the draw. The Kings take it along the wing. Drives to the sweet spot. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Quick pass to Foley Army. From center, they get into the attacking area. Takes the feed. Denies it in front. Puck picked up by Puglia Army. Oh, and it's another save on the play. Los Angeles with possession in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Dowdy. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Los Angeles has it against the half wall. And puts it just wide. The goalie was late reacting. If that puck hits the net, I think it's in. The Oilers win it in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Yamamoto. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. Hitting up along the boards. Puck grab by Deneau. Oh my goodness, what a hit! Edmonton's ready to go on the attack. Moves it to Nurse. Takes the pass. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Here's a short pass to Perry. With the stop. Ooh, picked up a play out there. Hangs on to the puck. LA's got the puck. Directs it on over to Moore. The Oilers have the puck now. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Cuts into the paint. Stones him in front. Quick 
Bucks on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We've still got zeros on the board. Mata stick handling in his own zone. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. The Kings gain control of the puck. Los Angeles moves it ahead. Roy's got the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Athanasiu. Edmonton's got the puck. The Oilers in transition at center. Here he is from the slot. Gives them nothing in front. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Taken by Watt. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Athanasiu. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Here he is, shot right in Whoa. front. Scores! Up on the board. Yep, there's the goal for LA to start the first period. LA's got the position that every coach loves, the lead. Then you can use your bench, then you can use all of the combinations you might think will work. LA goal, this first goal of the season scored by Andre Smithers. His first assist by number nine, Alan Kim, and by number one, Osmond Brown. Time of the goal. Four minutes, three, three seconds in the first period. Seven minutes, 33 seconds in the first period of the game. Here's a shot. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Los Angeles leads it 1 0. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Kings play it along the boards. Edmonton's gained possession. Puck scooped up by McDavid. Cutting to the slot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it. Look out. Look out, and yep. We have to stop the play because there's something else bad happening. LA penalty, Matt Roy, two minutes for a roughing. Edmonton penalty, Connor McDavid, two minutes for roughing. Bogotar's got that quick pick zone ability, which means he's great at using his stick to disrupt passes and intercept pucks, guys. He can really get his team going when he transitions from defense to offense. Two minutes for roughing for Edmonton and LA. Meeting now four on four attack in the first period. Two minutes left to remain in the penalty. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a face off. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. The Kings take possession off the face off. Dowdy's taking it from his own end. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. The Oilers take over on possession. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. LA's got a hold of the puck now. Gaining momentum along the wing. Takes the feed at the point. Bouchard's got it in the defensive end. Edmonton's in now. Quick shot. Makes the close stop. Quick's gonna slow things down and up for the whistle. Well, you gotta kill the play eventually. That way everyone can get reorganized. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. LA's up one step. The Kings win the draw. LA's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends a pass over. That goes off a play. Smith's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Los Angeles takes possession off the faceoff. And there's the save. Good save. Positional save through traffic. Things start to get a little physical out there. Takes it into the slot. Tremendous. I thought he had it, but I think they're saying it's a goal now. That's in the net. Well past the mid 
halfway mark of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. It's Oilers goal! His first goal of the season, scored by number 13, Hesse Pornery! Time to go! Goal! Oh. 15 minutes, 32 seconds! In the first period of Stanley Cup playoffs! Los Angeles wins the face-off. Loose puck battle along the boards. Taken along the wall by Arvidsson. Deneau's lugging the puck. He got all of that hit. Slides the puck over. Receives the pass. On the attack along the boards. No room for that one to get through. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Dreisaitl's effective because he distributes the puck so cleanly, guys. His tape-to-tape -tape zone ability is what helps him set up his teammates for success. The Kings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Slides it across to Watt. Pushes it across to Kempe. Looking to set up offensively. A chance from the slot. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. I think that was from the body, from the chest. It looks like we're going to keep an eye on him later to make sure he's okay. And the managers will have it all. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's all tied up. LA's won the face off deep in their own end. Nice pass. Moves it quickly over to Deneau. Handles the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Handles the puck at the point. Coming to the front of the net. Turned aside with the glove by Quick. Sometimes you make a good shot and you just get beaten by the goaltender. I'd say that's one that you put in that category. Both teams ready here for the faceoff. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Los Angeles plays it against the boards. Grabbed along the board by Downey. And now it's over to Moore. And no luck on that pass attempt. Los Angeles has it in the open ice. Takes the feed. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Big save by the goal. Oh, off the post. So close to jumping into the lead. That shot hits the goal post. And the game will remain tied. That was so close. Almost would have gotten a goal. But it was off target. Picked off. Tries to get the puck to Moore. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Los Angeles looks to go on the attack. And there's a shot. And that's denied by Smith. Makes him all the oh. runs. Puts it into the back of the net for the goal. Yeah, breaks this time, Jake. Sometimes it stays that way a long time. The 
the Kings have gotten themselves off to the start they wanted with an early lead. Always better to play in front. You can dictate the matchup. LA goal is first goal of a season, scored by number 33, Victor Arvid. Time of the goal. 16 minutes, 11 seconds in the first period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. The Oilers gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Answered the call there. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Dumps it in. The Oilers have it now. Moves it to Fogel. Edmonton's got the puck against the boards. Fogel's got it to the side. LA's got possession of the puck. right into him. That might loosen a few of the chompers on that play. And it's a quick pass to Fogel. Here he is, wrestling on that. Great stop by the goaltender off the glove. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Final minute approaching here in this opening frame. One minute left in the first period. Here in the late going of the frame, Los Angeles is trying to build on that one goal lead. Oh, what a little stick lift on the play. He comes up with the puck. Cuts to the paint. Blocked in traffic. LA's on the attack. The Kings have it from the corner. Edmonton's got a hold of the puck in their own end, but the clock is winding down. Sends the pass over. Left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this. 2-1 lead. LA. We'll be right back with the second quarter. Right after this. On now to the second period. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. LA's won it. Puck grab by Downey. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Maintains possession. Hard on the play. Why did he ever finish him hard? And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Beats the puck. It looks like it wasn't. No, he didn't break the break the stick. He lost it, and then he had regained control. So yeah, it looks like he lost the puck. Sorry about that. Ooh, almost had it in the other lane. That was close. Locked it up. Los Angeles, throw the ball with the fight. Time and a penalty for Everton. Andre Kane, five minutes for, for fighting. Both teams lined up in the 
face-off circle after the ice was finally decluttered moments ago. Byfields won the face-off. Five minutes roughing for the penalty in between the Edmonton and L.A. seconds in the second period in the Stanley Cup playoffs. to midway minute under 10 minutes.
into the corner of the attacking area. Take it along the wall by Brown. Back at the point, he set it up. Makes the save. Smith's on top of that one for a whistle. A little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Past the midway mark of the frame. We got a tie game. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Taken by Moore. And he comes up with it. Move to the middle. Puts it on net. Again, the denial by the goaltender. That O's looking a little rejuvenated. He had that fight earlier. Now he had a five-minute break to rest, but he's back at it. And a good shot on goal. And that's stopped by Quick. Los Angeles moves ahead with the puck. The Kings ready to go on the attack. How did he stop that one? Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too. So there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeeze through. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. The Kings will go to work here in the offensive zone. And he makes the save. Quick feed to Deneau. Stops him again. Doesn't lose his focus as he makes a couple of quick ones in a row. Feeds it over to Keith. Yamamoto's got it across the line. Pops up with the block. Turn that chance aside. Moves it to Arvidsson. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Fires it, and he comes up with the save. They fight for it along the boards. Excellent stick work on the play. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Misses wide. This is why you have to be prepared for your chance. You don't know when it's going to come up. You get it, and you miss the net by that much. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Bouchard. Into the attacking end. Centering pass. Turns it aside with a glove. Right from the most dangerous area on the ice, the goalie flashes the glove. That's an arrogant stop. More than half the period has expired. We are all tied up in this one. Puck grab by Nurse. Passes on over to Pugliarvi. Here he is in front. Stopped by the goaltender. They work the puck into a scoring spot. Get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Grabbed along the board by Nurse. The Oilers have it now. Receives the pass. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Sends it in deep. The Oilers gain control of the puck. Here's a short pass to Brown. Levels him with the hit. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Quick pass to McDavid. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Quick. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. Late goings of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Puck scooped up by McDavid. Oh, what a quick save by Quick! Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. Got it in the offensive zone. Great reach with the stick by Puglia Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Quick. Yeah, I hate it when I miss chances like this, James. You don't get many that are this. They score! The Oilers goals! Third, second goal of the season, scored by number 13, Phil Pugliori. Time to goal, 60 minutes.
at Goiler's Goals. First goal of the season, scored by number 93, Don Orbean Hopkins. Here's a sense by Graham Ryan and by Darnell Nurse. Time of the goal, 1633, remaining in the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Anderson's going to play it against the half wall. From the slot, fires away. Oh, there's one more. I thought they worked the puck around pretty good here. They get a good chance on goal, but not to me. Quick feed to Ryan. Last end of the offensive zone. Los Angeles takes hold of the puck. Edmonton's got it now. Takes a hit on the play. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Hammers one at the net. Big time stop there. Smith's been a strong link in the chain tonight. Everybody's pulling in the same direction. The offense one minute left in the second period. Second period nearly in the books here. Anderson's got the puck in his own zone. They go on the attack through center. Let's it fly! And then carries off a stick. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Picked up along the boards by Arvidsson. The Oilers have it against the wall. Moves it to McDavid. Nice pass. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. Oilers looking for a chance to take the lead over the LA Kings as we will take the intermission re report here for a second and we will come back to the third period to start things off to finish it off. Alright now, time to finish the third period and then the Western Conference for the first part will be finished for the Stanley Cup playoffs first round with the first game. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Oilers lead it 4-2. Kopitar has won the draw here in the offensive zone. Play blown dead, let's get the call. Edmonton penalty, just as well as Two minutes for tripping. Los Angeles gets set to go to work on the power play for the first time tonight. Well, the power play gets to dust itself off here. First opportunity tonight. The frozen Two minutes penalty for the line with the Oilers. It'll be a power play for LA Kings. Melvin Polybert, two minutes Los for you for tripping. Five on four on the attack of the third period. Here's a short pass to Kopitar. That's on the stick. And they send it down the ice. Los Angeles has it behind the cage. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Skates to the crease. Comes up with a stop. Smith's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Kopitar is looking to win this draw, this man advantage here. Los Angeles wins the draw here in the offensive zone. Quick pass to Arvidsson. Edmonton's penalty killers get a hold of it. And they kick the puck out of the defensive end. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Moves it quickly over to Kopitar. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Throws it in. Los Angeles gets a hold of the puck against the boards. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Oh, he gets a blocker on it, but a stop by Smith. Edmonton's penalty has now expired. It can't be much better than that from the PK. They do the job, and they're able to retain their lead. He was locked in there. Denies him again. Quick reflexes give him the opportunity to make back-to-back -back stops. 
Lots of time left in this period. Edmonton spin the better club as they hold a 4-2 lead at this point. The Kings take possession off the faceoff and puts the body into it a little bumper car hockey. Great poke check on the reach. Skates across the blue line. And there's the save. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. LA's won the draw. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Dreisaitl. Pass to Dowdy. Gains the zone from the right. Quick feed to Ayafalo. Long chain in front. That's broken up. Slides the puck down low. A chance! Oh, gets a blocker on it to turn it away. Picked up along the wall by Kippen. Oh, that's a huge stop by Smith. Play kept alive into another pressure cooker situation. Handles the puck. A chance! Oh, close save by Quick. Knows what a big draw on their own end. Takes the feed. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Snaps one on net, and that goes off a player in front. Right up the gun into the attacking zone. Here's a shot. That's blocked by Quick. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The Oilers have some breathing room as they lead by a pair. It's 4-2. Deneau's won it in their own end. Directed over to Arvidsson. Carries it across the line. Moves it to Moore. Denied by the goaltender. Smith's got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on him pretty quickly there. Like everything else tonight, he really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. LA's won the face-off. A blast! Denies him with a save! No corner given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Stopped by the goaltender. Los Angeles gets the puck near the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Here's a chance. Oh, off the crossbar. What a chance on the play. Los Angeles comes so close to getting themselves into a position to take over this game. Momentum won't change as that hits the post and stays out. Pumped away. Edmonton's got possession of the puck. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Oilers will play from the defensive zone. Steps inside the line. Here's a short pass to Barry. A chance in front. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Slides it back to the blue line. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in his own, so this is a good play. The Kings win the draw. And the intensity start to ramp up here after that hit. Quick pass to Kopitar. And he gets in the lane to block that. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Roy's gliding the puck along the line. Oh, fantastic save by Smith. Moves it quickly over to Barry. And now he moves it to Yamamoto. Moves inside. Denies him in close. He looked up to the roof after that one. He thought he had room. The goaltender makes the stop. And that's stopped by Smith. Kopitar is exploring options with the puck. Sends the pass over. And that's broken off. Now yeah, puck doesn't get to the net. Good positioning by the defender. LA's game position. 
official on the boards. We're under a midway left. The Oilers have it from their own end. From the left side, they gain the zone. Slides it over to Athanasiu. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Yamamoto. The Kings gain possession in their own end. LA's got it in the offensive zone. The Kings have it now. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Edmonton's doubled up on them. It's now 4-2. Puck picked up by Nurse. Hyman's got it along the boards. Quick feed to Pugliarvi. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Oh, what a save! much tonight, Ray. No, they'd have to play really poorly to screw up this now. They have played outstanding hockey. Oilers goal! It's third goal of the season. Scored by number 13, Hesse Flory! And that fails to materialize. Assisted by... And by number 22, Frank Kirby. Time of the goal, eight. Time to go 13 minutes, 40 seconds in the third period of the Stanley Cup playoffs. That's an important stop for the goalie. Not only does he make the save, but because he catches it, he kills the play. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. Edmonton's won the draw. Tries to the paint. Stones him in front. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Deneau's got it in the offensive zone. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Through center. Edmonton saw the attack. Chance in front. Oh, how did that stay out? What a toe stop on the play. He's sharp on that one. No one to go for the puck. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Oilers just recently adding to their lead. They're now up by three. Kopitar's won the draw. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Tricital's lugging the puck. From center, they get into the attacking area. And that's picked off in front. Kopitar is swooping in on the attack. Edmonton's got the puck. Here's a short pass to Dowdy. Let's it go! Too much congestion in front. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. The Kings have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Good reach of the step to knock the puck away. Denies him with a save. And now it's over to Keith. The Oilers move to the offensive zone. And that goes off the player. Keith's holding the puck. Takes the feed. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Quick shot with the stop. Los Angeles moves it ahead. Here they are on the attack. Stopped by the goaltender. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. Check in with our own Carlin Bain. Who had the better night in that head-to-head -head matchup with the Stars? McDavid's the player I think had the edge in tonight's matchup, guys. The deciding factor for me was the difference in points between the players we highlighted earlier. He obviously had more offense in tonight's game. Come on the boards, they battle for the puck. And now he moves it quickly to McDavid. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Puck sent over to Mana. LA is moving it into the offensive end. And now he angles it across to Deneau. Denies him! He got all of it! And he 
finds it quickly to Mata. Here's a shot. Big save. Hyman's got it in the defensive end. McDavid's picking up steam. And now he tries to get it across to Hyman. Gives up nothing in front. These are frustrating. You don't get many chances like this. I thought he made a good shot, but the goalie, an excellent stop, beats the shooter. Here in the late goings of the period, the Oilers have been the better squad so far tonight. They lead it 5-2. Edmonton's got it, and they're on the attack. Takes the puck, but still hangs on to the puck. LA's got control of it now from their own end. Drives it to the crease, and the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Rister denies it in front. That goes off the post and stays out. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Center's gliding up to the face-off dots here. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Barry stick handling in his own zone. Quick pass to Pugliarvi. One minute left in the third period. With the stop. And that shot dies in traffic. Great read with the stick. Moves it quickly over to Juan. Here's a shot. Can't save. He's on it tonight. LA's won the draw. They'll go to work. Tremendous hit against the wall. You think there's a sliver of room there, James? There's none. And he got caught. He's going to go back to the bench and want to look at that one again. He had enough time to really make a good shot. I don't think he quite got it where he wanted to. Move to the middle. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in the scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Almost finished right now. The next game will be the one versus four seed as it will be the Canes and Hurricane play against the Bruins at Boston. Slides it up ahead for the right wing. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. There's the final horn sound and putting this baby to rest. The Oilers pick up a big win despite sort of an unconventional approach tonight. They would have liked to have the puck a little more, but I guess when you look at the clock, you're like, nah, that's for next game. We scored a ton tonight. Well, with another home team victory, you know what that means. It's time to party. Yeah, the fans get to salute the team. The team salutes them for sticking around and cheering them on through this game. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us tonight. Thank you for joining us here for another Western Conference games of the Stanley Cup playoffs of the Kings and the Oilers for the first game. We'll tune in for the next game as you will have the first seed take on against the fourth seed and it will be another one here for tonight. The Blues and Flames at St. Louis. Time for three star players of the game. Number three is Zach Hyman, one goal and one assist. Put a lots of effort out there and that was a tape to tape. What a play here, good drive. Number two is Jesse Pugliarvi. Three goals and two hits. Now that is a great shot. That's a great angle with the back hook. And there is a backhand shot. And two of them as well with the hit. Number one, that's Mike Smith. 55 saves, .965 saving percentage here for tonight. Well played. So that ends the first. So if you're joining in for the next game of the Eastern Conference Series, it's coming up next as we have the Hurricanes and the Bruins ready for you in action. So, that's it for the Western Conference. Peace out everyone for as a while as the Stanley Cup playoffs of the NHL 22 dial. Next game is, will, be, will be on its way when we take a break and then we'll get back into action. See you guys later after this.